What's good, YouTube? It's your girl, Tracy, and I am back with another hair review video. As you can see by the title, I am reviewing Maxine Hair. It took me so, 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 so long to make this hair review video because I want to try everything with it, and I want to see how well it can hold up after a long period of time. So I am finally doing the hair review video that I've been saying I will do for so long. I just want to start off by saying that Taiwan is still not back, so I am holding up pretty strong. Um, right now, he can't text me because he's on a mission or whatever. So it's been like a good week since I've texted him and stuff. So, But I'm sure he's fine. Um, he'll be coming back in October, around October, somewhere in that range. So I'm excited for that right now. It is, what, March? So I got a long way to go. But as long as the days are moving closer and closer to him coming back home, I'm excited about that. And I also want to say that if you are new to this channel, welcome. My name is Tracy. This is a couples channel, but for now I'm doing a beauty channel just so that we can have some activity on this channel. This channel will just be dry because he's gone. So yeah, I'm doing all of my, my hair stuff on this channel. If you are a returning subscriber, what's up? Welcome back. Let me jump right into the hair review video. So if you guys haven't seen my old video, you should go check it out. It's the Maxine Water Wave hair. I did straighten it for reasons that I'm going to tell you about. This hair took me a long way. It's been about two months. I'll say a month and three weeks to be exact. But So it's been around two months. Um, I usually wash my hair once a week, but I try to wash this hair a little bit more than once a week. So like maybe like two times this week, one time this week two times this week, three times this week, you know, just so I could really get this hair's true colors out. Like, I wanted this hair to be, you know, all the processing that they did to make this hair how it was when it first came. I wanted all of that to be gone. I did deep condition it a couple times so that, you know, like, just just to really, really test out this hair. I wanted to see it this its full potential. I got the inches 20, 18, 16, and a 14 inch closure, but like, you know, a frontal. So I'm gonna start with the pros. What I really like about this hair is the frontal is so natural. When I was bleaching the knots to this frontal, it was so smooth, it was so easy. I, it took, you know, it didn't take that long. It didn't over process. It, it wasn't hard to process, like it wasn't hard to lighten. It was so smooth. I do put a little bit of makeup on the on the cap when I do put it on just so it can match my skin color. I'm a darker skin color, so, so it can match my skin color better. It's still soft even after two months. So I really, I just, I really, really, really just love this hair. But even though I love this hair so much, really, even though I love this hair so much, it still has its downside and it still has its cons. One of the, um, the biggest pros is um, even with this hair straightened, when I washed it like two days ago, I, you know, to see if it was still, the curls will still come back and it definitely, definitely, definitely did. So I really, really love that about this hair is that the curls come back like you never straightened it. So that was a great, that was a great pro. That was a great, you know, I kind of like that a lot. Um, another pro is, um, the hair does take heat well. I think I said that already, but the hair does take heat well. And it's still like, you know, silky, it's still bouncy, it's not stiff. Like, you know, after after you straighten curly hair, sometimes it just be like, I, I don't wanna move, like, no, that, that's it for me. But this hair, this hair is really holding up. I really do like this hair, but I think that's pretty much it. Like, you know, I, I like this hair like I like when I first got it. It just, there's just some things about it that was just like, I wasn't expecting that, you know, like I wasn't ready for that, I didn't sign up for that. But um, I do like that this hair was very affordable. The closure looks so natural. I love this hair so, so, so much. This hair is so gorgeous. It's so beautiful. But now let's get to the cons since, you know, y'all probably don't want me to talk about the pros all in the whole video. So one of the cons is that the ends got so matted at the ends. And like in this area of the frontal, I had to pluck the frontal extra. Like, you know, I had to go back in and really, really pluck the frontal because when the side of the frontal got matted, it made me look like I had a freaking, like, extended head or something. Like, the frontal got so matted on the side, so I had to pluck it so that when it did get matted, it wouldn't be as matted. 
it wouldn't be so much hair that it was just like a huge ball so I didn't go back in and really have to pluck it so that the sides of my head wouldn't look so big like during the day because in the morning when I you know wipe the mannequin when I wipe the hair down and put on the mannequin head it's you know it's cool in the morning I have no problems at all like even with the ends perfect but I was like going through my day at the end of the day it was just a disaster like the ends will be matted the back the back of the neck will be real 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 it'll be so matted and um the side of the frontal this side this side was always fine i never really had a problem with this side but this side was so matted and just so like tangled i had to read i had to detangle it every single night so that's when i was like you know what bump this and i really just plucked this side of the frontal and cut the ends i cut the ends more than i had to but that was just my design preference um because I was like, I'm cutting the hair anyway, so I just went a little bit more than I had to. I was just trying to split, like, you know, cut the split ends because, you know, no, I think that it was combing the hair and wherever the comb stopped is where I cut. So this is, cut. I cut a little more, like just a little bit more than I had to, but it's, you know, I still had to cut the hair a lot. So that was, that was one thing. Um, the back doesn't get as mad at anywhere because it's straight. That was why I had to straighten the hair because i just i wasn't dealing with the matting even after i plucked and even after i cut it the back the back of the my hair where you know it touches my neck gets matted so 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 bad and also um the side of my hair it got matted still it didn't get matted as much because i plucked it but it still got matted and i just didn't want to deal with it no more i was like i'm done i'm not dealing with this no more I was like, yeah, so this is gonna be straight hair now. I don't really have a problem with it because I like the hair. The way it looked when it's straight, it looks natural and it looks like really pretty, but it's like, you know, I, I kind of did like that option. The, there's one more thing that I really, really, really hate about this hair. I really don't like it. But the reason why it's like not so bad and you can't really tell is because this hair is so full. And it's not the bundles, it's the frontal. Okay. The hair sheds so much when it's wet i'm talking about even if you have like a spray bottle and you spray the hair and then you just brush it you just get so much hair from the frontal and it's not the hair it's the actual frontal like i don't know if it's because i bleached it but i didn't i bleached it for like no more than 10 minutes like 10 minutes is even too much i bleached it for like five five six seven minutes like one of those and the hair gets so like it just sheds and sheds and sheds I get, I literally get like a ball of hair every time I wash this hair, like a ball, like a ball of hair in my brush or a ball of hair in my hand when I wash this hair. But when it's dry, it's like, you know, it's like it's like I don't have no problems. When it's dry, there's not one strand of hair at all. When it's dry, there's no problem. But when it's wet, it sheds like a dog. Like it sheds and 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 sheds so i mean that's like but like i said the hair is so full that when it does shed it's just like okay you know i can't as long as i can't tell like i don't have no bald spots that's my thing that's why i'm so surprised because i don't have any bald spots at all so i'm really surprised about that i have no bald spots in the frontal the frontal looks like you know like it doesn't shed like it doesn't look like it shed but it does it sheds so much so that's just something to look out for when you do buy this hair you know my cons do seem kind of like harsh like overall i will still buy this hair again i don't have a problem with buying this hair again i would buy this hair again but my only thing is that it's very irritating because it sheds and it tangles so much but other than that i'm cool i'm chilling the hair is cute i still get compliments um like and you can't even tell that i have some dookie braids under my under this like my braids are so messed up but you can't even tell because like you know the hair is just so pretty and so cute i still get compliments and stuff so yeah that's pretty much it i don't really have anything else to say let me see i haven't dyed it that's the only thing i haven't done is dye it i washed it more than i have to i straightened it and then washed it again to see how the curls come back and you know i have a plus for all of those except for the shedding and the tangling that's the only thing um and other than that it's you know the hair is pretty cool i like it i don't really have any more cons to say like that was those were the two major things that i noticed i haven't dyed the hair i think i should dye the hair to tell you how it takes to dye but 
based off of me dying the knots it was you know it was cool so I mean I guess it tastes dye good because it took it took the um when I was bleaching the knots it took the dye good so I mean you know but I'm talking about like with colors and stuff like if you want to like put some blue in there or anything I don't know how well it's gonna take it if you lighten it and then put the color so I don't know I don't really know but you know I do really like the hair and I do recommend the hair I do think it's worth your pennies because it was inexpensive it lasted me so long and looks like you know like I just got I just got it installed so I also did purchase some more hair so I'm gonna do a review on that so stay tuned for a hair review video um, and I will also be doing an update video on how I am holding up while Taiwan is gone. So, yeah. Two videos coming your way. Make sure you check them out. Um, I think that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. We are going on 200 subscribers. I'm so excited for that. So, we are just going to keep growing. And we are just going to keep doing amazing things. I, um, I actually got... I actually got some good news that I will probably tell you in the next video because this video is getting kind of long so I have some good news that I will be telling you guys so yeah we got great moves coming we got big moves coming so make sure you keep supporting us thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video